Hey guys, this is Nonsense with Natasha, and what I want to talk about today is don't give up. Please don't give up. Please, like, seriously, don't give up. I know everyone is starting uh, New Year's resolutions, and I'm sure some people have failed already, and that's okay, guys. We're not perfect, and I feel like people think they have to do things perfectly in order to get results, but we don't because we're not perfect and it's never gonna happen. So just go in knowing that we might fail sometimes, but you pick yourself up and you go back at it. You have to think each day is a new day. We can decide what to do with it and you can either decide to continue with your resolution or you can decide not to. Um, yeah, uh, I think one thing that occurred to me is that if you guys have done like streaks where you sort of see days consecutively that you've been doing whatever you want to do, like, it's really encouraging to get you to continue, like, to persevere, but if, when you miss that one day, like, it is heartbreaking, seriously, because it, it shows a zero, and it honestly feels like, what was the point of all this, what, like, n that was, it's like I've done nothing, but really, you have done a lot, and I think we just need to look at it from a different aspect. I started thinking about it as what if I got a dollar for every day I did what I wanted to do? Okay, example. I was doing my fitness pal and I did it. I wanted to get 365 days of logging in and entering in my calories, but then at the last week I went on um uh, a Christian youth camp and I didn't have good Wi-Fi and I was just really busy so like I think a few days before I was about to hit the streak maybe less I didn't log in and so it went back to zero and I was so mad and I was furious and I was like ah oh, what's the point of it all no uh, yeah, and I was so frustrated that I didn't go on it, but also I went on vacation, so I was like, no, I'm not going to log these calories. But the thing is, like, I never got back into it after that. And I I have, like, I, I haven't been able to maintain the weight that I was at because of that I haven't been logging my calories. And it's like, ugh, Natasha, like, you just missed, like, a few days or a week. Why would you stop all that progress, almost a full year's progress, just because you ruined your streak? That's dumb. But I feel like a lot of people are like that. I know, like, people have Snapchat streaks, and when it goes, they don't want to go to zero. Can't let it get to zero. And when it goes to zero, it's like, no, what's the point of it all? Um, but yes, like I was saying, if you look at it from the view of, like, each day you get a dollar for doing it, a dollar, a dollar, a dollar, like, I would have had, like, $363, probably, and if I missed one day, it doesn't negate all this stuff I've accumulated, all this good stuff I've accumulated, and I could have just missed that day and kept going and going and going, and the more you get, the smaller that little mistake, you know, even matters. It's like a blip. It's nothing. But instead, I let it totally derail me and affect the rest of, like, this these past six months. And I was just like, what the heck? We can't let that happen. So don't give up. Keep on going. Each day is a new day. Don't let streaks bother you. Think about what you've done cumulatively and how um, that doesn't go away, even though your streak goes away. Okay, that's all I had to say. Good luck on the new year, guys. Bye.